move on hello ni hao hong kong this is your friend james in olympia washington state united states of america 2020 has been a very very busy um involved year and I want you to have a Merry Christmas. I want you to decide to have a Merry Christmas on purpose. This is very important. Have a Merry Christmas on purpose. Decide. Because, hey, a lot of stuff's happened and a lot of things people just been, you know, hitting back and stuff like that. But you're a human being made in the image of God. So that means you have the ability to change your circumstances and situations. I know communist China wants to push you down into subservience to where you're just slaves and just members of the state where somebody else makes decisions for you, but you're made in the image of God, and they know it. That's why they do that. People who had communist countries and stuff like that, they do that on purpose because they like telling you what to do because they're made in the image of God and they want to control stuff. But you, I want you to have a Merry Christmas on purpose. You can decide to have a Merry Christmas on purpose. You can, in your mindset, you're going to end 2020 better than it started. Despite what any wicked people are doing, they'll be mad, they'll be pissed off because you're pissed off. They'll be really upset because you're having a good, peaceful Christmas and they're not. So I want you to have a Merry Christmas on purpose. Three points. One, decide to have a Merry Christmas. You have to make a decision. Many people fail because they don't decide to do it. They just hope they're going to have a Merry Christmas. Champions who win the championship decide that they're going to go to the top and do their best. So decide you're going to have a Merry Christmas. Mindset, as he thinketh in his heart, so is he, is what the Bible says. Your mindset determines your reality. So decide to fight for a Merry Christmas. If that means stop listening to people, stop watching certain TV shows, listening to certain news, hanging out with certain people, visiting certain relatives, being on social media, hanging out with that friend that causes you problems, any, anything that's going to hinder, that you already know you got a conscience, you smart, you know what causes problems, you know which particular house, in your of your relatives you don't need to be visiting because every time you go y'all start arguing so that's if you're gonna fight for a merry christmas to labor into rest as the bible refers to you need to stay away from anything that's going to cause problems if it's the donut shop because every time you get around there you can't stop eating donuts then don't hang around and then you feel all guilty well don't do that on christmas eve this time so decide and so fight for it. So that means you have to make some energy towards your main image of God. Press against something that and fear and things and fear that would stop you from having a Merry Christmas. And three, pray so towards somebody else having a Merry Christmas. You can pray for your family for a peaceful Christmas for your city. You know, Hong Kong have a peaceful Christmas. And you can sow towards this. You can pray for yourself as well, but you can sow towards other people having a peaceful Christmas. You know, you can, and bless Christmas. Do something for your family, your friends. Your friend likes a certain, you know, video game or whatever. If it's a good game or whatever, buy them the video game. Or a t-shirt. They have a favorite, you know, they have the game or whatever. They got a favorite t-shirt or something. Sew towards that. Give them a gift card. Take them out to eat. So make them a Christmas card. Call them and say, Merry Christmas. You can call them now and say, Merry Christmas if you're a little intimidated. And you haven't been doing that. But you say, well, Merry Christmas. It's December 1st. Have Merry Christmas. So I want, this is one thing I want you to do. Is sow towards somebody else having one. Because the Bible says you do reap what you sow. So have a Merry Christmas on purpose, Hong Kong. And remember, live movie.